DNA testing of his elite breeding stock is taking the guesswork out of joining and putting Kangaroo Island farmer Andrew Heinrich on a fast track to improve profitability. Mr Heinrich is incorporating the cutting edge technology into ram selection at his White Suffolk and Pole Merino studs, with high hopes for what genomic testing will be able to deliver for his business in years to come. In our whites, we, we use a lot of uh, ram lambs because we always try to find the next best thing. So we, we would use about 12 to 14 ram lambs. We, we genomic test all them and we've been doing our merino size as well. In, in the whites, uh, we look at the eating quality. So if we know there's one there that's not hasn't got good shear force or some muscular fat, we most probably won't go on and use that ram lamb. Uh, we also use that because we use ram lambs and we only keep a couple of older rams from that group for the next year's mating. And we're using the genomics test there to give us some more confidence that um, this, is, this is what the mating prediction of it. Mr Heinrich said a long involvement with objective breeding tools such as lamb plan had already significantly boosted profitability on his farm. Taking part in the sheep CRC's genomic trials and adopting DNA testing into his breeding program was the natural next step. We're hoping that, and I, I believe, it will speed up our genetic gain. And if it speeds up our genetic gains, it's going to improve our profitability. And we've seen that already through measurement, through land plan and merino select. Um, we've, we've made huge gains. As part of the DNA profiling of breeding rams, he will also test his merino size for the horn pole gene to ensure that he meets his objective of breeding easy care sheep. Oh, yeah, it gives us confidence. Yep, and also gives us confidence if we use a pole ram, we can ask for that genomic test now and if he's got the double pole, because we've got a lot of horn in our flock as it is, because when we started we, we used either poles or horns, we didn't really care. Now we've made a decision that we need to go to poles for, um, for easy care, really. Mr Heinrich believes DNA testing offers huge opportunities for the sheep industry, particularly for meat eating quality. Consumers in the, you know, that go to the supermarket and buy meat, they need to have a good eating experience and we need to produce genetics that will throw consistent eating experiences with lamb. So the, the housewife, the average person, knows that this lamb's going to produce a product that's consistent.